Hey folks, thanks for tuning in today for another video. So, as you can tell, back out here in the woods today, so it's a beautiful day out. It's uh, already like 80 degrees, so i um, getting pretty warm here. But, anyway, I got a, a little breeze blowing, so it's not too bad. But, anyway, what I thought I'd do is I thought I'd um, show you a new Alpha Outpost box uh, for this month. So, that's what we're going to do in this video. So, um, stay tuned. My name's Chris. You watch Skills to Survive. We'll be right back. Thanks for watching. So, down here, I'm close to my camp, so what I did actually, I'm, uh, I built a, a smaller camp over here closer to my house. I uh, built a fire pit and uh, laid some rock down and, and stuff like that, so I'm actually closer up to my house because my family wanted somewhere uh, where they could, we could all hang out and do a fire in the fire pit and stuff like that, so anyway, so that's what we did. That's what uh, we did past few weekends was build this fire pit up here and so it's going to be a nice little camping spot for me as well. And as you can tell, hung up my hammock here. I got space here to hang up a couple of hammocks. Uh, space here to do, you know, all kinds of little stuff, you know, overnights and stuff like that. Plus, I got a good sized fire pit as well. So, I digress. Let's go over this box. Let me go get it. See what's in it. All right. So I brought you down here to the, the new fire pit here. Let's open the box. See what's in it. All right, so this month is called Bino. So obviously, looks like there's some binoculars in here. So you got some binoculars, a harness, a lens pin, and some reflective trail markers. Um, tells you some, gives you some tips on if you get lost in the woods, and shows you how to hook up your uh, your harness. So check it out. So here's your patch. Looks like it's called Lost. Pretty cool little patch there. Uh, here's your Here's the harness. We'll uh, go over that some more in a minute. Here's a little lens pin. Kind of keep your lens clean. That's always nice and pretty cool there. Oh, oh. Trail markers uh, came in this little box. and You see they're reflective trail markers. I'll have to put some out on some trees and, uh, and show you. But like Basically like thumbtacks. So, couple of stickers, a couple of Alpha Outpost stickers, which is pretty cool. So here is the binoculars. Let's open them up. Let's see what we've got here. So inside there, we've got a nice little, nice case here. This is a, like a felt type material case. Open this up. And here's your carrying strap for the case. Binoculars here. Yeah, a carrying strap for the binoculars looks like so. Hey, look at these binoculars here. Looks like these are these are 10 by 42. So pretty decent uh, decent magnification, decent power there. So I like the lens covers here. They just pop down, they're rubberized, so they just pop down there. That's really nice. So I like that. Let's see the top cover here. They just pull off, but you attach that to your strap. So let's um, let me go over and check these out here and uh, see. How All right, welcome back. So I've been I got the harness connected here, as you could tell, and. Um, I've been walking around the woods for a little while just kind of seeing how it feels and I don't have it adjusted quite right for me um, but it's actually very comfortable I've never had a, um, a pair of binoculars or anything with a harness um, so yeah it's, it's pretty comfortable I could see if you were gonna wear this all day you know in the woods you know or out in the field or whatever glassing you know for animals or you know or whatnot I, I can see where this would be uh, more comfortable than carrying you know the strap 
you know, around your neck or something like that because, you know, your neck will get fatigue and stuff like that. So, but um, this is, the harness is actually pretty neat because it does have quick releases on it. So, you know, once you, you know, once you get the harness on, you can easily just pop it loose and, uh, and take it off. Um, so that's not that big of a deal. But, so, that being said, Overall, what do I think? Um, I think these are, you know, pretty nice binoculars. I don't have a set of 10 by 42s. I got a, I got see, I got a set of 10 by 50s. I got a couple sets of 10 by 50. I've got a, an 8 by 25 or 8 by 20 or something like that, little small ones. Um, but these 10 by 42s, I think are almost, uh, you know, the perfect size for um, going out for a day or so of, you know, scouting around stuff like that. It has this nice rubberized coating on it. I know you can't really tell, but I mean. I said, I mean, only only time will tell how they'll do, right? I mean, it's they're binoculars. I mean, obviously they're no Steiners or uh, anything like that, but I think for for what I need it for, I think these are going to work out pretty well. So anyway, I've kind of rambled on again as usual, uh, long enough. So thanks again for watching, folks. Um, get outside, get outdoors. Always remember PPE, plan, prepare, and exercise. Always make sure you have the necessary skills to survive. And um, I'll see you on another video really soon. And uh, I'm going to kick back here in the, uh, the siesta hammock and relax for a little while. And I'll catch you on another video really soon. Get outside, folks. Thanks for watching.